Hello everyone, my name is Vos Jozef and I am Mr. Muset. It's that time of the year when a lot of artists are creating art with ink, participating in the Inktober challenge. Last year was the first time when I attempted to take part in this challenge, but unfortunately I didn't finish it. I created 23 illustrations of 31. Back then I followed a witch-themed prompt list created by another artist. And all the illustrations were made with fine liners in one of my Moleskine sketchbooks. This year I wanted to make it a little bit different. I don't really have enough time to create an illustration every single day only for this challenge. Because I have a full-time job and I am a freelancer illustrator and mostly all the time I have commissions to complete. And this month will need to prepare for an event too. But about the event I will speak a little bit more at the end of this video if you will stick with me. Now a little bit about my this year's Inktober plans. Because as I already mentioned I cannot draw every single day an illustration for 31 days, I decided that I will create an illustration for every 5 days. I took the official Inktober prompt list and for the first illustration I tried to include the first 5 prompts, which are Ring, Mindless, Bait, Freeze, and build. Based on this I started to sketch out an illustration on a mixed media A3 paper. When I had all the sketch on the paper and I was pleased with it comes the inking. I used only black and white ink from Koinor for this illustration and I tried to play with the grey shades making the ink lighter using water. It's really nice to work with ink because you can build up the shades like you can with watercolor. Only the good thing is that the ink, after dried on the paper, cannot be reactivated with water, which I really like. After I finished with the grays, I started to make the line work using a dipping pen. First I was a little bit afraid that I will screw it up, but after a minute I realized how simple and great it is to draw with a dipping pen. For now on I will use it more often even at making the line work on watercolor illustrations. For the background I used the pure black and in the end I added some white stars and some highlights with the white ink. I think that I included quite well the prompts in the illustration and I am happy that I decided to create a bigger illustration for every 5 days of the Inktober. In this way I will have a more complex illustration series created only with ink. For the next illustrations I will use some colored inks as well. So stay tuned because will be up some other Inktober videos until the end of the month, so push that subscribe button under the video. Of course if you enjoy to watch my creative process. Also I have a Patreon page too where you can support my art if you want to do so. And about the event I mentioned at the beginning of the video, from 18 to 20 October will be the first Transylvanian Comic Con here in Cluj-Napoca where I live. I applied for the artist alley and guess what, I was accepted. So I will be there with my illustrated products and art prints. I am a little bit nervous because I took part at a lot of design fairs but this will be my first convention. So see you there with those who are coming to the Comic Con, search for the purple Mr. Musette banner and stop by to say hi. Thank you for watching and do not forget, life is a song, illustrate it.